So you're saying that the meeting went late? You know what? Yeah, it did. You got football boots in the back, dirty cups, bloody hell, food wrappers? Are you serious? You know what? Next time you go to the mall to get your nails done, or your hair cut, or your cunt waxed, or whatever it is you do there, just drop it off at the car wash and you know what? They'll wash it for you. This was perfectly awkward like it was supposed to be when meeting a new boyfriend with couples fighting at the beginning. Everything was timed perfectly to really up that awkwardness feeling of meeting a new boyfriend, of fighting before you go out with friends. The very last scene with that last line that was delivered perfectly with dinner and the show, it was really everything was timed just perfectly. It felt like you were actually intruding in something very private, but you couldn't look away either. It was really well written, brilliantly acted. It had great direction. This film all around is a really humorous film to watch because of the level of awkwardness it is for these type of situations. The filmmaker captured it perfectly. I really loved the performances. I thought they all uh, really dug into each of the characters and they all had a, a great sense of um, complicated dynamics, which ultimately then rubbed up and bounced off of and juxtaposed the other personalities and wants and desires at the table. I and mean, it was just really ripe with possibilities and conflict and, and humor, seeing all of them in their own wants and needs and sometimes not at uh, congruent moments. Great opening. It just pulled me in right away. I felt like I was in the backseat of this car listening to this argument just like this everyday normal argument this couple is going through on their way to their friend's house. Um, I just instantly felt pulled in. It feels like a series to me and I was kind of dropped in the middle of it um, or at the beginning of one of the episodes. Uh, and it just, it made me laugh um, sort of when they get to the door and they're like, hi, you know, like everybody's kind of putting on a facade when they first get there. Um, and then I, I love the character, you know, when the guy comes to deliver and then the, the other, one of the husbands invites him in. I love that. That was, a, that was a surprise. I like it when some, you know, when a show or like a film surprises me and that part was a surprise to me. I was like, what is he doing? And then, oh yeah, he wants to look like he's giving and caring <laughs> and not cheap. So that was funny. It was a really big surprise when the two were messing around in the bathroom because I didn't see any kind of indication between them that there was anything going on. But um, this, you know, kind of built up the characters a little bit for me and then it was over. So I really wanted to see more. It left me wanting to see more, which is great. I think each character, each actor was really good. I think each one had a developed character. I think we all probably know awful people like this. Um, I think when they all get together in, in, in the same room, it can be um, pretty unbearable. Yeah, I think I, I, I really identified though with the, uh, the delivery guy who got stuck there uh, with them. Um, he was the me in the film. And I think the audience will probably filter the experience through him mostly. Um, so, yeah, but, you know, it was, just, it was well paced and, you know, we had lively music going and everything was uh, had a good energy to it. So, um, you know, I'd be interested to know if there's more because we kind of got left with a little um, cliffhanger here. Uh, maybe it's part of a series. One of the things that I think it did very masterfully is set up the tone. Um, you start off with these two couples bickering. And you find out that they're about to have a dinner together. And right there, it sets up the stage for just sheer insanity. Um, I absolutely enjoyed every minute of it. Uh, like it. Like it presented in the beginning, there were so many twists, so many turns, so many uh, wild cards that played a role in this that I... <laughs> it was like a roller coaster. There's definitely a moment of suspense between... Um, what was going to happen next and the characters were, were going to join the scene um, and a really unexpected ending with the setup. So I, I think it, it was a really interesting scenario and choice and way of presenting the information and it definitely made it for a comedic effect by the end. 
So I really enjoyed that. I thought that was really great, especially when you're playing up this idea of couples. And then clearly at the end, you have this decoupling new couple that obviously gets caught. But I think that when you're playing with couples like that, it's such a fun idea. And I really enjoyed it as introducing everybody as a couple and, you know, then taking it from there. Uh, I really enjoyed that. I thought that was really great. And then the, of course, like the reactions at the end that you're, you know, expecting. And then just clearly that's not what anybody was expecting the reactions to be. Uh, I thought was really great and a great twist.